guys this is Hawkeye and we are here in the Hemondal and we're pretty much going to be after anything I think aren't we <laughs> anything that moves I mean I would like to get a reindeer I would like to get a brown bear and you would like to get the ptarmigan yeah I'd like to get a chance to knock down a couple ptarmigan I don't have one in the uh, trophy lodge yet and I know you'd like to get a reindeer for your trophy lodge and potentially a brown bear for your trophy lodge. Oh, yeah. I'm definitely. currently streaming and Hawkeye is recording. And so if I'm talking nonstop while we're going along, it's because I'm talking to my stream. But I think we're looking pretty good. We are uh, just south of the uh, permanent hunting tower I have here in Heimendal. And... Uh, if you want to go over there and see if we see anything from the hunting tower, we can do that. Or if you would rather get a wander on, um, we can we can wander the reindeer route. I mean, it's whatever you would like to do, man. All right. Well, uh, where's this ptarmigan place that you're wanting to get to? Um, the ptarmigan are up in the northwest. So we, if the... you look at your map, you'll see that up in the northwest that there's an exclamation point up there. Yeah, I see it. They're kind of due north of that excla exclamation point. They're all up in that area up there. Okay. All right. Well. So what we could do is we could head over to the tower on the reindeer highway. Okay. And then, and after a few minutes there, there's a route that I can take us that usually is really good for reindeer and moose pretty much all the way up to where uh, where it is that we find the ptarmigan. Yeah, that sounds good because I want you to be able to get your get your uh, trophy for your trophy room. All right. Well, let's hit our scent suppressor and let's head on over to the tower. All right. Let me get mine. Where did I? Okay, I do have it in the right spot. Surprised. But oh. I started us earlier than I usually do simply because I knew we'd both have have prep to do and. So we have to head north to that tower, or? Yep. Yep. Okay. We gotta gotta head on up to that tower now. Usually, if I'm coming in to to specifically hunt moose or reindeer, I'll come in at 9 a.m. for this clearing that we have up here. But the reason I started us at 5 a.m. is because if we walk this reindeer route, this reindeer and moose route that I'm talking about, they tend to be more responsive early along the route that that i'm i'm gonna lead us so okay that works yeah this is where you and i right, well, we'll slip on up in the tower I should tell you how long what... tell you how long ago was the last time we were here was when that bear came right over there over on the uh side i'm looking at and we yep. didn't notice it until and then he, then he he bolted right as i was trying to raise my my gun. Yeah, it is eerily quiet. Me? I have not, well, I haven't heard a single animal call. I have not seen a single track. What the heck? Is it too early? No, I mean, I've, I've come in here at 5 a.m. and hit reindeer right up on the hilltop. Come through here just butt loads of tracks going down all the way down to where the standing stones are. It's just odd. That's why I remarked about it because it's just odd. Hmm. I, don't know I that's... think that rather than uh, sitting here in the tower, 
I think the thing for us to do is to actually start working our way north and west because I have a feeling that that's what's going on is that the animals haven't made their that they come up through here in the late morning but usually they kind of go from they go north and east down into the eastern side of the map and then they cycle back up again at about nine o'clock in the morning and they don't seem to have actually gone down on their original passage through so mm. probably the best thing for us to do would be just to head right out of here because i don't think we're going to see a darn thing okay and for us to just uh do the reindeer walk because like i say this is eerily quiet Let's just say it's so too, we'll be it's heading down quiet. into the valley here and then depending on what we spot in the valley either heading over towards the first lodge or angling up across it depends on what we hit track and noise wise down here because a lot of times we'll get down here in the valley this early and we'll start hearing reindeer and stuff all over the place yeah but usually there are moose tracks up here there are roe deer tracks up here there are reindeer tracks up here there are brown bear tracks up here usually this clearing is just a hotbed of signs in fact it's why i've hunted this clearing for so many years because you know why I got my my tree stand up there and stuff. It's it's really active, really hot, and this hillside going down here is almost always just covered in moose tracks and nothing. I haven't seen a thing. Yeah, yeah. It is like I say, it's almost eerie the complete lack of signs of life. But the this hilltop here area where where we are now, there's a lot of brown bear come through here, so I'm keeping my eye open for tracks. All right. And they start working this pretty early, so. I wouldn't mind getting a brown bear. I don't have a bear yet, so of any kind. Oh, you don't you don't have any bears in your lodges? Not at all. No. Oh goodness, we must fix that. Uh, if I'd have known that, I'd have insisted on Timber Gold Trail, and I'd have taken you to Bear Central so you could get a grizzly. Well, I'm, I figured we'd eventually do that, but. Uh, I just haven't been here in a while. I guess I just wanted to come here, see what I could get. Oh yeah, yeah. And this is this is a good map if you if you can walk it the right way. There's a lot of interesting animals to hunt, but I've not heard a single roe deer. I've not heard a single fox, and they're like the the icons of this map. And we've seen just the tracks of just one animal, so they're all held up on the west side of the map. I was going to say, it is eer eerily silent. Silent. Mm -hmm. Silent. I can't talk tonight. Oh, boy. Yep. There we go. There was finally a beeper. He's just it's ahead. It's male, too. too, and he's just ahead. Now, have you got a roe deer? I don't think you I do. I do not have a beeper yet. I'll be damned. I'm surprised. I figured I'd been... I do not have a beeper. In huh. fact, I was thinking about calling Jan Beeper and seeing if I could take him just to have a Beeper. Well, you need to get unless you a Beeper. You, of course, unless you, of course, want him mm. wholeheartedly, in which case I would I would pass on him, but... No, go ahead. Honestly, go I ahead. I think... Okay. Well, then I'm going to get out the Beeper Stinky and my Beeper and see if I can pull him up here. Okie doke. I'll tell you what. If you hear a bear, if I can go after the bear, I'd appreciate that. Yeah, well, I figured you had first dibs on reindeer and bear. We had equal dibs on moose and the roe deer, frankly. I didn't know. Is that that cow? Yeah, yeah, that's that cow again. I have not heard that beeper again. Oh, by golly, I think I might see him coming. There I'll he is, yep. All right, over there, hold nice and still and see if I can get the shot. What's he I think look he like? may see me. No, I can't see him. So, I don't have eyes on him. Yeah, and I can't tell if that's a buck or a doe. Yeah, I figured I, I was going to get spotted here, despite the fact that if I check my camouflage... Oh, well, that's interesting. Why would that be? What? My face mask shows green, but the rest of me does not. What? Wait a minute. Maybe I better check mine, too. 
So I'm wearing the same thing you are. So apparently being in the open, we have zero camouflage. It's only when we're in the trees with this gear on. They changed that. It used to be that anywhere on this map, you were considered camoed. So I'm they have altered that. Well, no wonder you ran away. I'm considered camo. I'm all... Wait a minute. No, as soon as I walk down the snow, it disappeared. Yep. Once I get in yeah, the grass, see, that's... It... I'll be damned. Yep. So you, oh, well. stood, you stood out like a sore thumb then. Yep, the only part of me that that wasn't easy to see was my face, which is the scariest part of me, so that's probably a good thing, but... Now what were you wearing with oh, the scarf he wasn't, that wasn't he, shown? He, yeah, he wasn't, uh, he wasn't magnificent. He was he was an all right little road deer, hmm. but I'm not heartbroken. Yep, now I got camo again. That is so stinking weird. Okay, whatever. Yeah, yeah, see, I'm all camoed up now. And it's just, it's a matter of uh, being in that open field with just the snow. Oh, what would you have to wear, Arctic or something? No, because there's no other no other winter camo. I mean, there is the Arctic camo, and I suppose in theory that would that would do it. But sometime I'll we'll have to check test that out just to see. But nice. lots of snow. Mm -hmm. One thing I like about this map is it's real easy to see the trails or the tracks. Yep. I mean, it's not so bright. Even though I've got yep. the sunglasses on, it that does help a little. But all right, so we've got his track right down there, and he called from up over here. So I think if we stick to this side of the rock, we might be able to get eyes on him over here. Okay. Got to be just right out there somewhere. But yeah, I don't... I've come across some awfully dandy moose right over in this area, so, and he's, he's estimating top end 550. Damn. And there's a fox up on the hill. Just dropped a mark on him. Were you trying to get a fox? You don't have a fox yet, do you? No, I don't have a fox yet, but I'm not so concerned about that. Um, I would like to find this big old Marty Moose, and I'd like him to be a big old monstrosity. Oh, yeah. Like. Marty Moose, so Marty Moose. Yuck! <laughs> yep, 420 to 550, and this is, this is showing... Ooh, I'm getting a... Solid... There he is. Okay, he just called. He is right up the hill this way. Yeah, I heard that. He right is close. Up the hill this way, yep. I knew he couldn't be very far out. As long as we stay where we are, we're pretty much invisible. Just checking to see if I could get up on that rock, but I can't. Too steep. Yep. There he is. He just turned to run. Son of a gun. Son of a... What, do you see us? I don't know, but he is not a bad moose hawk. He's not a bad moose. Well, let me In fact, give a... I, I marked the spot where I lost last saw him and checked my scent suppression. I've, I'm at four minutes. Yeah, me too. Well, hmm. I don't know why he scockered, but like I say, I marked the last point that I saw him. Well, my camouflage is fine, so... Yeah, yeah, that's just it. There's, there's absolutely no reason that I can think of that he would have ran like that. But I mean, he definitely panicked and ran. But he was a good-looking moose. Hmm. He, he wasn't a leaderboard moose, but he was definitely better than most of what we've been bumping into lately in uh, White Rhyme. Yeah, I've been running into mostly 110s, 120s. That's yeah, pretty yeah, much same here. Odd. 110, 120. If you find a really good one, he's maybe pushing 135. Yeah, I've been back a couple of and times so, just to see if I could do better, and I have nothing. I mean, it's just not been. Yeah, I, I managed to uh, pick up that 
that 170 or whatever he was, and I haven't seen anything better since. Should we call him in? There he is. He's right there, Hawk, right on the hillside. You think I should go hot? I think you should go hot. I don't know. Take a look at him and see what you think, but I think he's a hell of a moose. All right, let me see. He's estimating as high as 215. I'd Jesus. go hot and knock his ass down. There you go. Good shot. You nailed him hard. Okay. That's probably one of the best moose that we've seen in an awful long time, brother. Okay, there he goes. He's, he's down. down. He's down. That's one of the better moose we've seen in a long time. I think it was worth going hot on that fella. Oh, yeah, definitely. Might as well just stand up and walk since things will have well, I heavily hit... left the neighborhood. I don't think he's no, no 215, but I think he's going he's gonna to come out better than, than what you got on the wall. In fact, I think he's probably going to come out better than what I've got on the wall. Well, I'd just be happy to get better than what I have on the wall, to be honest. I wanted to get something a little more representative of the species. Not that that was a yep. you know, sorry one or anything, but still. You know, his, his plates aren't satellite dishes, but he's got lots of good points and... Uh, seems to be that's what matters with the scoring yeah his points yeah he's got he's got lots of points and and i mean he's definitely an excellent example of the species of the species, of the species. <laughs> we are here to hunt the elusive moose yeah see he's a good looking fella now, of course, as deceptive as the scoring is, watch him be a 12, but, I mean, that's, <laughs> that's not bad. His, his nice. plates aren't huge, but he's got a lot of points, and a lot of the points that he has are fairly long, so let's see what we got here. He looks awesome to me. Yeah, One... it'd certainly be a, yeah, a 147. Yeah, that's better. That's just, better. Yeah. yeah, at least he's an excellent example. I mean, that'll look good on the wall. Oh yeah, you know. I think I think it's much more emblematic than than the one you've currently got up. Oh yeah, definitely. Shoot, I wish I had bought those damn trophy shots, but I guess I'll try to make this work. What the hell are you doing, dude? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think. God, it's always so hard to do on a hill. Yeah, yeah, if you could step yeah. forward a little bit markers. towards him a little bit, I'll be able to get you in here. Oh, okay, sure. Okay, that's what I wanted to do. It's a little dim, but yeah, you can really see the spread of those antlers the way I've... And yes, I do want to taxidermy him. All right. Put him All on right, that. I love Drop the dot for the direction we need to go from here. I think it's your toying. <laughs> and, yeah. Um, well, we should, in theory, be moving into some very, very nice uh, reindeer territory here. And we're we're pushing up on 7 a.m. now when everything starts to get real active. So we'll see what we see. Now, you did see that. You had a really how. good reindeer, though, didn't you? Yes, I, I got one that was a, a very good example of, of the species. So I didn't know if you needed to get you one or if you just had one up on the wall for sure. I thought well, you I said you did. I've got a decent one up on the wall. And if we spot a herd, you know, if we spot a herd, we'll see if we can do a, a countdown shot or something. But Well, this like time say, this you is... count. This time you count. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> some reason when we did it last time, I think when I take the shot, it cuts out your sound. Yeah, well, you pretty regularly, for some reason, on Discord, you'll be talking, and I lose part of what you say. That's weird. Yeah. 